Codable.io overview. Hey guys, welcome to this new video. In today's video, we are going to introduce you to Codable.com, which is a platform connecting businesses with vetted WordPress experts. It provides a marketplace for outsourcing WordPress development projects. Clients can post their projects, receive bids from qualified developers, and choose the best fit. Codable.com ensures high quality work, transparency, and accountability throughout the development process. So let's dive into it, guys, and let's see how this platform works. So this is the main page that pops up after writing Codable.io in our search box. So we have here the logo and we have how it works, the how it works section. If you need any question or you need to know how it works. And here we have who we help. So you can see that they help a business owners, agencies, and also freelancers. And you can see the developers. You can browse through the developer directory and you can also apply as a developer. And here you have the pricing and their partners. So you can, part they have a partner program. They have the affiliate program. So you can refer, refer a friend or your family and you can get paid and you, they have the partner directory and partner login. So we have here the login button. If you already have an account, you can just hit login. If not, we are going. If not, if you want to start a project, you can go with the start a project button. But for now, we're going to create a new account in this platform. So we hit login and we wait for it to load. So if you already have an account, you just type your email and your password and you hit login. If not, you create a new account. So you hit create an account and you fill this information, you type your first name and your last name and your email, then you create a powerful password, then you hit I agree to the Codable user agreement and terms of service and you type, you type create account. So I'm going to fill this information and get back with you soon. So this is the page that take that they take us to after filling the information. So as you see here, our account has been created. So from here, you can see the projects that you have, or you can also create a new project. And you have also, if you want to, to add a new project, and you can see here your stats, the spend so far, the average project size, and here you can see your account, the transactions and if the settings if you want to change anything in your profile like your email or your name or last name and if you want to log out from the platform and here we have all our projects the one in progress the one that's pending archived or our favorites so let's go guys and create a new project so we have to create a new project so as you see here, you can submit a project and it's free to post a project. You can hit here to start a, pro a project. And if you want to consult an expert, you can start a consultation. So as you see here, consultations are charged at the fixed price of $69 for an hour. So if you want a consultation, you start a consultation. And if you want to start a project, you hit start a project. So as you see here, you fill this information. You see, you see what you need help with. So let's say developing or designing. And let's select what we are developing or designing. Let's say an e-commerce site. And then you hit continue. And here you have create a title for your project. Let's say let's 
let's give it a name then let's describe our project in as much detail as possible so I'm just gonna write something to describe it but I advise you guys to write your real information right here so I'm going to see I want to build a website for a clothing brand so as you see here they say they say description should have at least 100 characters so you need the guys to write to write and type at least a hundred characters describing your project as in as much detail as possible and this is this will help you to find the, the right fit for your designing or developing or any project you have in mind so after typing your description you provide your project URL which is optional if you already have an, a new URL you type it here if not it's not a problem and if you also have a file that will help in the project you upload it here if not it's optional then you answer this question this question if you'd like to invite specific experts to work on your project whether it's yes or no so after filling all those informations the description and the URL then you can hit continue if you're not sure if they can help if you're not sure you click we can help to see why you need to proceed and create a project in this platform so let's go back let's go back and see what do we need to do if we want to start a consultation so let's let's hit create a new project and let's go to the start consultation option so as you see you also need to write your consultation details so briefly you describe what you, you want to discuss right here and then you provide any additional details preferred contact method etc and then you provide your project url if you, if you have it if not it's optional and you answer this question if you'd like to invite specific experts to work on your project by yes or no then you type publish consultation and you will be good to go so that's it guys for today's video i hope you find it useful don't forget to like share and subscribe to our channel and see you in the next videos